Hello, my name is Mark Force, and we're here today to discuss entering materials into L4U via the Checkmark feature. Checkmark is an L4U annual subscription service that uses the power of the internet to locate the materials you are cataloging. This greatly speeds up the process of moving the items from the box to your shelf. As with any item record entry, Checkmark is used in acquisitions. This could be in textbooks or the general collection in library management, as we are here. You need first to get to Acquisitions, so you can click on Acquisitions from the toolbar or from the button on the main page. Once you're here, click Add. After you've decided how you're dealing with the accession number, click in the ISBN 1 field. ISBN stands for International Standard Book Number. It is a 13-digit number that's used as a unique identifier for books. ISBN 10 is the older 10-digit format. And ISBN is used internationally. It's the quickest method to locate your item via check mark. You can search for materials using the title, author, and publisher as well, but the ISBN is the fastest way to locate the item. Once you've located the ISBN on the uh, the item that you want to catalog. In other words, newer materials have the ISBN 13 on the back jacket, and better yet, if it's on the back jacket, it's quite often in barcode format. So all you need to do is just scan the ISBN barcode in the ISBN field, one field, like so. Click check mark. After a moment or two, Elfie will do one of four things. Locate an item with a book correct book cover, or locate an item without a book cover, or locate an item with an incorrect book cover, or just unable to find a match. In this case, we found an item with a correct book cover. In this case, Elfie has found a record at one of the four sites. Each of these tabs shows the number of items returned by that site. Here, both the Library of Congress and Amazon return one record each, and the currently selected record summarized below these tabs. Elfie selects the local uh, Library of Congress as the default record, as we assume they know what they're doing. The book cover is always supplied by Amazon. If the summary here and the book cover match, then all you have to do is click Import. If the record is not to your liking, click one of the other tabs that has a hit. In this case, Amazon. The collapse button allows you to see and review any other hits from that service. Of course, we only have one hit, so there isn't any of the records to look at. However, I have a fondness for the Library of Congress service, so I'll click that tab, review that record, and click import. Once the imported record is in L4U, then you can make any necessary changes to the rest of the record. For instance, the barcode, better known as the accession number, up here. There's more information on that in another video tip. And then deal with the rest of the local holdings. And we discuss the local holdings in another video tip. Once the record is the way you want it, click Save and head on to the next item. What to do if the found item has no book cover or an incorrect book cover? In this example, there's no book cover. So what do you do? What you want to do is review the selected record and pay special attention to the title, author, and publisher in the summary area. If these three fields are correct, then there's a very good chance this selected record is a correct item. Sometimes it's a correct record, but an incorrect book cover. All you need to do, once again, review those three pieces of information and the rest of the record, then import it acquisitions, and then you can delete the book cover from that record at that point. Once you've determined this is the correct record that you want, click Import, and then deal with the other fields, such as the local holdings, barcode, etc. We cover that in another video tip. 
If Elfview did not find anything, then you will have to see if a copy exists in the Union Catalog. You may have a copy of this item on your shelf, or a copy may exist at another campus. Please refer to the copy catalog and view the Union Catalog video quick tip. Thank you for your time and have a great day.